Yeah. You got a phone? It's always good to have more than one video. How much more do you have? I'm doing like three minutes probably. That's what I had last time. What did they say that he said it was going to stop? Oh, let me speak to that one I was talking about. I'm going to be, you know, doing the construction of the shit. I had a dream that uh, I actually pulled a couple of how you might see out of the tent. I was like, I don't know what I'm saying, man. Motherfuckers ain't with the truth. Ain't with the truth. But then when I woke up, the demon's talking to me like, go go and hang with the man. You know, seriously, when you put thoughts in your mind, like, they brothers. Like shit like that, man. And that's a constant tug of war when you're in the world. You know what I'm saying? You're fighting with that shit, man. Fighting with it. That's crazy, man. And when that's what's that? Where's that at? Where's that at? Man? That's Ephesians two and eight, two and six, I think. Or and we wrestle not against flesh and blood. Do you want this? But against powers and principalities and powers. And I can't. You know you roughly paraphrase. I already got a Bible. You don't have it. Huh? I got two Bibles. This one's raggedy. It's actually pretty good. Yeah, but the precepts are gonna be going off. No, I'm gonna. But he's a thing. That's what got the better precepts. Huh? No, so you get that one. Messed up precepts. No, but look, that was a better shape though. I like holding and touching that one better. Look at this one. It's all beat up. Hey, this dude got a good precepts though. What did y'all want to go into? Oh, shit. Good feature. Yeah, he's good. Oh, yeah. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Yeah. Well, we're talking about the two. We're talking about uh, niggas in the purple and the red. You know? The niggas that ain't working at all. Well, that's here. Let me just pull up. They ain't got no reason to be out doing the work anymore. They're, they're relaxed, they're comfortable. They ain't got no reason to be going to work anymore. So what the scripture say, it says, but he that don't work, don't eat. He that don't work, don't eat. What piece of scripture? That's the scripture. That's the Yeah, no, 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 Especially day of the circumcision. They know they're Israelites. It says especially those of the circumcision. Those are the, the people who know they're Israelites. Those are the main ones you gotta watch out for. Hey, check it out. And you know how long we've been out here. All knowledge people acknowledge the Israelites. But are they doing the work? Nope. Nope, nope. Are they studying to show themselves the food? Nope. 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 <laughs> you know? I know they're Israelite yeah. though. Cause that's that good sweet city you know, they heard. They stuck to it. Oh, he is a But that's all, that's all the furthest right. the two birds are going with. That's the furthest they're going with. Oh, yeah. They circumcision, they're talking about the people. All right, you got a circumcision of the flesh and circumcision of the spirit. The spirit? We, I mean, we physically circumcised, but you also got to be spiritually circumcised. Circumcised really means like to make you clean. Because if you're uncircumcised, that means you're, you're like a heathen. You're unclean. Yeah, you are unclean. You are unclean. I had a dude, man, before I talked about it. Like somebody wanted to talk about a penis and shit. But that's what this foul motherfucker talked about with his uncircumcised penis and how it smelled like fish, man. 
nasty as fuck. Yeah, hear women talk about how nasty it is. Well, they suck in the fuck up. They expand it. Yeah. They expand it. Church is called called a uh, congregation of Gentiles. Huh? I know they got rid of them. Oh, yeah, that's right. The, the Gentiles are uncircumcised. They call their congregation Gentiles. They're saying that their congregation is unclean. How dumb is that? Well, talking to those. Talking to mental freaks. First Corinthians 12. Let me read the rest of this while you get that. Well, well, Titus 1 and 10, for there are many unruly and vain talkers and deceivers, especially they of the circumcision, whose mouths must be stopped, who have subvert whole houses, teaching things which they ought not for filthy lucre's sake. Right, and at the end of the day, the only reason that you'll see IUIC people out here, or the, the companies people out here, because they out here trying to get some money. Cause that guy Nathaniel, he's in there for the money. He's in there for himself. And they get these fools in their congregations and they just get them for every dime they got. They'll sell you Israelite starter kits. You know, the official, the official Israelite starter kit that's gonna cost about 400. I don't know how much they charge. Those motherfuckers take credit cards and everything. Yeah, they take credit cards, of course. These are like starter kids. That's fucking and crazy. And to top it off, you do that one dude from IUIC. He's a detective. Now, how are you going to How are you going to trust somebody that's a detective? I, that's crazy. If I come up like, hey, what's up? We're going to let my dude in the camp. Hey, but by the way, he's a de detective. But it's cool, though. You ain't going to be trusting that guy. If I brought a cop, and just a, not even a detective, just a regular cop, and said, and I'll throw some fringes on him. Like now he's in the camp. That's why my homie. Mm -hmm. You know, but after he gets off at camp, he gotta go patrol the streets, write tickets. That's crazy. Okay. Okay. And if we had a cop in our camp, we'd be like, see, told you. Why you think they're working? Right? The cops are fussing about it. That's crazy. They don't have no reason to get in. They go into the camp. But that's the blood on our that's the blood on their hands. Yeah. That's the blood on their hands. I mean, sometimes you gotta point it to somebody's mind. Long time. They can't put it in words. They can't put it in words so they understand what it is. Mind, give a reminder. Oh, you yeah. give people a reminder, man. Yeah, yeah. yeah that's a reminder. You keep coming out here to get this constant reminders to somebody here teaching. Yeah, they come from feeling good, they can take five minutes out of the game. They don't know, they don't, they can't explain why they do But then all you guys who come around, they, 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 they dig a deeper hole for them, man. Check out your board. You know? Oh, hell no. <laughs> yeah, those guys dig a deeper hole in the pool, man. They're ridiculous. They're not a joke. It looks like an homage. Wow. That was a creepy look. And you see how UIC will not come out here around us. Every time we try to talk to them, they always they always run. Yeah, then they'll listen, they'll scatter them. They'll retreat. It's like retreat, retreat. And they take off running. This is Hey Comfy, I saw you, but remember when he's out on uh Cleveland, Cleveland Avenue that one night. We ran into uh I don't even know the name of that with the Comfies people. With the, yeah. the Red Wolves. We ran into them. They literally, we came up and talked to them. We got said this is him. I walked up to him and they did this. They kept scooting away. We was like, hey, we just got a question. They'd be like, and then, and then we kept talking to them. They just literally jumped in their car and peeled off of us. They got the fuck up out of there. Literally, that really happened. We got the video. It's like something out of a cartoon, you know, when the cartoon car peels off, the wheels is falling off. You know what I mean? The action, it says, to defend the car. Yeah, and then after them clowns left, after we ran them, we didn't, the Lord ran them off. We was just trying to talk to them. But then we ended up teaching them there for like a couple hours. Some other faking that's in the life. 
Yeah, they do this. 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 They uh, Egyptian <laughs> and the Hamite, and you know that you were Gentiles carried away into the dumb mind, even as you know. Wherefore I give you understand, I give you to understand that no man speaking by the spirit of Yahweh Shai calls Yahweh Shai first, and that no man can say that Yahweh Shai is the Lord but by the Holy Spirit. Yeah, by the Holy, the Holy Spirit can even let you say that. So that's why it is no Edomite out there that's ever going to say, you know, Yahweh Bosh and Yahweh Shai is his power, it's his God. He ain't going to say that. Because the, the spirit won't even let him say that. But they'll come out and say, in the blood of Jesus. In the blood of Jesus. Jesus. That's a demon, that Jesus, that's a demon. And he just read too, the scripture said what? It said that you were Gentiles. Meaning that if you believe in the gospel, and the truth, it means you're not a Gentile, it means you're an Israelite. If the scripture says you're not a Gentile, why would you call yourself a Gentile? That doesn't make sense. It says you're not a Gentile. So that means you are a Gentile? I was just be trying to figure out the logic of the church. It's church. So so called church. Don't make any sense. Oh, you see that? Hebrews, Hebrews 5 and 12. For when you or when the time you ought to be teachers, you have to leave the one to teach you again. Oh, that's talking about everybody but us. Everybody but us need to be taught again. You need to be quiet. Have that seat and listen, okay? Because you don't know what you're talking about. We don't only ones out here teaching the Bible properly. The churches ain't te definitely ain't nowhere as close to the proper interpretation. And then all these other Israelite groups out here, they're not teaching the truth right. They need to be taught again. And that's why we out here teaching. You got me to want to teach you again, which be the first principles of the oracles of God. First principles. And I'll be first principles. You know, you can't just like, say you wake up to an Israelite. You still got to cast off all that old man, all that other old man, you know? All of them, you know, and humble yourself. There ain't no other way. That's, like I said, that's the first principle. To humble yourself and start being more for again, you know? And unfortunately, though you like it or not, he can't get me to teach you something. Right? That's the thing, they look at you. Right. So they reject it. That's a, that's, a, that's a commandment. That's the first way to go. You go. Humble yourself. Learn all over. That's why you have to be careful with the training. Why you examine your people, so you gotta examine them motherfuckers too. You know? Because two months go by, that motherfucker come out and say some stupid shit. <laughs> you know? <laughs> wicked shit, too. Man, what we see. Witnesses. Think about it. Most of the people that come into this fall out the truth. So you gotta watch them. Like there's new laws coming out. That's the new covenant. You know how popular that is, man? There's new laws. That's, a, that's what a turkey would be. They, they say that the new law is not like a new customer. That's that new law they made up. I ain't never seen that law in the Bible. Yeah, oh, you gotta accept everybody. Everybody's equal. That's one of the new laws. That is. That is. That ain't nowhere in the Bible. That's what, look, look. That's what my cousin said to me last night. Like, how can I take you serious? Because, like, well, how you can't? But how can I take you serious? How can I take you serious when you get a when you got that grandma spirit? You got that no cussing grandma spirit. That is crazy though, man. I heard what the Church of England was saying the other day. Let your children choose their gender, man. That's, but they love science and DNA so much. They like, but DNA says you only got one gender. So go argue with that. Y'all like science. 
Ain't nothing scientific about a man thinking he's a woman. That, that means you got a fucking mental problem. That's what I was about to bring up. Go ahead. Or because oh, such. Sorry, uh, they just elected a, a transgender. Uh, uh, what, a mate? Was it a, a, a senator, mayor, or a house? I can't remember, a representative? So somewhere in Virginia. Remember, they elected a, a tranny in the office. That person's got mental problems. They don't even know what sex they are. So how are you going to let them be in control of your... Your city is right. That, that vibration of uh, confusion is heavy right now, ain't it? It's heavy, man. It's heavy right now. Now, that's what I was just... You know, see, now, the transracial. It's like it's racial. got this Edomite saying he's a Philippine. You can just choose who the fuck you are now. You can choose what you are, who you are. Well, I'm Bruce Lee now. Don't I look like him? <laughs>
that was on this corner at first, but what did they do? They, they packed up the run. And now they switched up their, we fucked their whole program up. <laughs> you know, they had to change up their whole program. Man. Come on, let me get But we tried them, man. We tried to be brotherly and talk to them, man. And they, 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 they failed the test by mine. They only want to talk to a brother. Hell, with Israelites, right? Yeah, Israelites, you can bring them back. Man, man, y'all got the truth. Like, you supposed, to be, you supposed to be fighting for this anyway, so you claim the most high and dealing with you. You should have no problem being out here uh, shutting us down. You feel me? Shutting us down. We might have to start going hunting. Yeah, we might have to go with the dog. Hey, I seen him out there on the east side by my house. Man, y'all was lucky I had, y'all was lucky I had to be at work. I wouldn't stop it. I would cut it all out. See y'all up there on Hamilton, Hamilton, the limits. So they failed miserably. Okay. So we did. We found out they was not apostles but liars. He gave them one chance to redeem themselves. You know what I mean? That's all it takes is that one wrong answer. He asked you. That was the most important question. And what do you say? Uh, the Lord, son of the Lord. He says he mumbled something and walked off. He they said something and walked off. Something about the Lord. They said keep the commandments. Yeah, there you go. Keep the commandments. The law. Yeah. Keep the commandments. No, wrong. Yeah, that's wrong. Wrong. You failed. Wrong. <laughs> uh. <laughs> the scripture clearly said, for whoever calls upon the name of the Lord shall be saved. Oh, you fucking jackasses. Right. So how, every, every read that scripture again, but the first I can't. Revelation 2 and 2. I know that works in our labor and thy patience. Look, and the Lord, it ain't no Lord work in our patience. We try to be patient. We 
you be getting on patience sometimes. Like, God damn, I'm tired of this shit. You got the patience. God damn it. Yeah, God damn, I just want to knock this motherfucker out. I don't But they can't see us. But we ain't, we ain't even choked nobody yet, so. I mean, we're doing all right. Because I don't know how you could do this for years without choking the shit out of somebody at least once. <laughs> you know what I mean? So that, <laughs> that's patience. <laughs> Every guy can. That's the best script. What? What? There's some motherfuckers walking in. That's the best script. They don't realize who they walk in the walk they walk in the door. You know, because it's. We get carnal too sometimes. We think carnal sometimes too. But you gotta say you though, know? we true, we've been doing it a while, we ain't knocked nobody out. So I think we're doing okay. When you think about it, when you really think about it, like we should have been knocking people out, choking them, strangling them, been arrested. Yeah, that's yeah, yeah, it's hard not to, you know, clothesline somebody. You like, what the fuck you said? They just set you off, you know? That's why you gotta be patient. You gotta be patient. You can't. You can't be carnal. You gotta be spiritual. Every day. And how thou canst not bear them which are evil, and thou hast tried them which say to our apostles and are not, and hast found them liars, and hast borne, and hast patience, and for my name's sake hast labored, and hast not faith. My name. That's so much heat. They say you know that we ain't fainted. We kept the patience. We doing this with labor. We out here working. For the Lord's name's sake, you know, and, all, and we can't bear them with your evil. That's why you see a faggot or a tranny walk by and you like, what the fuck is this faggot shit? You know, you, what are they doing? That too, yeah. But they ain't teaching the work. Yep. Right. And that's a good point. But they faggots too, though. Because a faggot is just a stick. And, you know, a bundle of sticks that you burn up is like two foot fire. That's the literal meaning of it. So I U I C there a bunch of faggots. We come out here trying to work hard, trying to start the They fucking come out here scattering the fish. You know, they, you know, you are you you out fishing, making noise. And down the right, right next to you, you got a little motherfucking pass and throwing rocks in the water. Yeah. And that's spiritually what they doing, man. It's like that old, yeah, that's a good analogy. Another one, another good analogy is like what they say they took. They took a shit in the, in the punch bowl. <laughs> you know, we got this good drink passing out. They want to come up and take a shit in it. I was going to say, I knew why they was out yesterday. It was like, what, six degrees yesterday. It was very oh, good. It was nice. It was nice. It was nice. <laughs> <laughs> what was I think mean, I was just speaking yesterday, actually. First Thessalonians 2 and 2, but even after that we had suffered before and were shameful to be treated as you know. At Philip, we were bold in our power to speak unto you the gospel of the Most High with much contention. With much contention? I'm sorry, we didn't hear you. King James. What were we just talking about that? Yeah, but well, they all say the same thing, bro. Right, right. No, they don't. It ain't the it just I mean, I would we have recommended King James though. King James is the best. We all got King James Bible. Because King James was the Israelite. That's why. What was it? What was it? What was it? I I I wasn't sure it was That's actually why I stood up. But what was King James? What nationality was it? Nationality? Yeah. As a what nation? What's his nationality? He died as a Christian. But what's, well, what's his nationality? He was pagan? I got a scripture. Jeremiah 13 and 10. What's the point? So why would a pagan make a Bible? Right. 
So he, so he published the, the volumes on Odin. You know what I mean? Edomites. 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 I bought them. Jeremiah 13 and 10. This evil people which refuse to hear my words. She, what, what you said? And, he had, and then she said, what's his nationality? Then he's pagan. Because right, right. you know pagan, that's what... Y'all seen the nation pagan, right? No. Nah, the pagan's yeah, part of the UN. Right, right. Pagan, yeah. yep, you got a representative. <laughs> yep, you got a representative. They got milkies. They got... Right. Pagan. It's like when you analyze what people say, right. this one, man, this is the hell with you. Dude. Right, you just got to just keep going with our thing, man. Jeremiah 13 and 10. Well, she went in anyway. She went in under shelter. She went out under shelter. It's going to eventually collapse. He just wants to make up. All that makeup. You stick to shelter. Makeup. Shit. All that makeup. All that pork. But you know that's what's in there. The restaurants, they sell their grease. Yeah, they sell their grease. They make a profit. That's great. They make a profit. They make a profit. They make a profit. That shit packed on. Trying to look beautiful, ain't I? I don't say beautiful. I know that. I think that and then she, heard, she said King James was a Christian at first, though. But then he's a pagan. <laughs> and but actually, though, you know what? I'll, I'll say this, though. Those Christians, though, they didn't have the truth 100%, right? Like the Anglican Church, King James, and all them, that they were still. They, they was going off on a lot of things. Right, but, it, right, but you, you can't, this is too high for it. For you can't go too deep on something. Right. You really discuss something. You know what I mean? Because they believe in the Bible, but they were still going off on a lot of stuff. Just like the Israelites that ruled uh, during the Byzantine Empire. They believe in the Bible, but a lot of them, was going, they believed in the Trinity. But then you had some Israelites who didn't believe in the Trinity. And there's always conflicting beliefs. So it was really, you know, uh, a more, uh, what's the word, it was more complicated, it's more complicated than it seems. Jeremiah 13 and 10, this evil people which refuse to hear my word, which walk in the, in the imagination of, the, of their heart, and walk after other gods to serve them and to worship them shall even be as a griddle, which is good for nothing. Hey, because, yeah, are you IC or you really worship the God of the Bible? They, they worship uh, yo yogurt, yo play. What is it? Yo play yogurt? How they say it? They said you can call uh, the Most High. What a yo play yogurt? They say so they don't they don't worship the God of the Bible. They saying that. Wicked flea. She walked away. She walked away. She walked away. She snuck across the street trying to escape. Scratch. She escaped. Right. Right. She, well, made a, she, sacked, she made a sacrifice of a fool. You flee from a bear, you're going to get bit by a snake. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. Damn, he don't you're going to run from us, you're going to run into something worse. <laughs> now, now the spirits are coming. Right? Y'all know what they're doing. Now, now you know, we, <laughs> y'all are sitting outside of the room. Yeah. You see her go on the bus and get right. off the bus? That's crazy. That's <laughs> crazy. <laughs> 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 know what the fuck. Yeah. She's lost Dan now. <laughs> She's really <laughs> lost now. You know, that's what you get, bitch. It says it's coming to a man of Lord and submitting herself like a woman. Now she's far worse than what she was. Fucking stinking, huh? Fuck. <laughs> All confused. I think she was. She deep. She go deep. <laughs> she go deep, all right. <laughs> <laughs> Titus, can you say? I got one, but what's the You said, uh, good for nothing. I wish you was. Uh, Titus 1, 16. They profess that they know God, but in works they deny Him, being abominable, disobedient unto every good work, reprobate. Right. She's talking shit. And that's, and that's that Titus going back into the circumcision, too. And uh, he's talking shit about the, the people who know the Israelites. Back to how you want to see. You know, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. You're you, at the level of the elevation. Because they, they like calling up, they like calling uh, the scattered Israelites heathens too. Because, like, the, a lot, like IUIC, they, if, 
No matter if they see somebody that looks like a heathen, they'll automatically say he's a heathen. You know, they don't, they don't teach the fact that Israel scattered. They, you know, they scatter among all nations. They don't understand it. They just going to do the obvious they going basically uh, solely solely upon a physical appearance. So that's wicked as hell. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. Oh, It says, Lord. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. Oh, has come upon them to the, utter, to the uttermost. Right, because you got a lot of these Israelite groups out here that are not teaching the truth. Right. So, so, so say they, if they see, a, uh, say, a Chinese dude, but you know, you, we can tell he's clearly an Israelite, but if they see him, they automatically go, you know, talk shit, say, you're, you're going into slavery, you're a goop. You know, they, they probably call me an Edomite. You know, you know what I mean? It, what? Roger never said that. When he said that? He said the first time on the campus. But the thing was, all he did was expose his uh, stupidity. Yeah. Because he was trying to bring that so called either mind this kid. Right. Yeah, because he would never answer that question. I always ask him, I was like, it is. I, I, I asked him, is the Cornell? He said Israelite. And he would never answer. He'd be like, I believe anybody who calls on the name of the Lord can be saved. I'm like, that was not the question. I said, poor day, they beat around the bush. Because if you got people saying the Edomites can be saved, you know they're not teaching the truth. That's what GOCC -G teaches. They say Edomites can be saved. Yeah, because they go on solely off of skin color. Because they might met a cool white dude once or something. And by all, oh, see, Edomites are cool too. They can be saved. No, he ain't no fucking Edomite. Yeah, he got actual Edomites. Yeah, he do got actual Edomites. <laughs> but you know, you can see how some people do it though. Because so, they're so simple, and they're always looking on the outward appearance. About, oh, all the light ones are Edomites, all the dark ones are Israelites. But at the same time, they'll, they'll call the Africans Hamites. They're retards, fucking retards. And, and you got ISUPK calling people from West Africa Hamites. Fucking retards. Damn near all them people in West Africa is all Israelites. You got people calling them Hamites. Like you, you know these Ghanese people, you met people from Ghana. Those are Israelites. People from Senegal. Yeah. It's all good. There's all kind of Guyanese people in Columbus. Man, it was all Israelites. Yep. All the, uh, what's some other countries? Singal, Israelites, uh, Liberia especially. Uh, the Fulanis are Israelites. What's some other Africa? Uh, uh, Libya, uh, Libya. What is it Libya? What's the other country? Niger. There's all Israelites. Yeah, all, all, all over the West Coast of Africa. Yeah, they predominantly Christian. They always get persecuted by the Muslims. And a lot of the Muslims over there be Israelites, persecuting their own people. Yeah, they have to fucking chop your hands off. Maybe they stay strong in their faith. Yeah, that's just, that's, that's nightmarish, you know. Gentile seat and his rest shall be glorious. Come on, y'all shall. 
line of King David. So that proves that, he, that uh, Mary was in a hurry. He says, it came to pass in that day, it's like an inner shot come to pass in that day, and the Lord shall set his hand again the second time to recover the remnant of his people, which shall be left from Assyria and from Egypt. Wow. So that's been scattered. You know, that country is just going to Mexico. <laughs> oh, they go to Jamaica. They go to Jamaica too. You know. Hat brothers. And that don't mean bringing in Egyptians. <laughs> I mean, maybe, there's some, maybe people can't get it, man. They can't get the mystery. We out here for the mysteries. So the Lord, the Lord revealed us the mystery. He didn't give the mysteries to everybody. So the reason it's called a mystery is it's a it's mysterious. You don't know what it is. So and it's not yeah. The secrets ain't give, ain't everybody in on the secret. You know, we don't. So the, we know the secret. It was given to us, not the world. Yep. That's what we here for. That's what I was saying about the Olympics and the people in the UFO cast a shadow. Man, that's a mutant, a major body that two thirds still did people for us. They, they always got a scene through, you know? They'd be like, oh, that, that was a meteor storm or yeah, right, right. Come on, right. some bullshit, try right. explain it away. Right. Here he shot with a great sign. Man, that blew my head. That shadow, you know this thing. Yeah, that was a good one. Right? Yeah, that was amazing. And that space station is massive. It's, it's bigger than that building down there, man. The, the diameter. Yeah, it's gotta be giant. It's giant as fuck, because it took years from the even the, parts up there. Even the space shuttle is giant. Yeah, they still build it. They still building that thing on the admin too. Because that space shuttle that's constantly going up there, it's called Dragon. That's what it's called, that cargo ship. That cargo ship. They're constantly ready for something. Oh, that Dragon won't be that war in heaven with the Dragon. That's probably one of the youngest. He's the bone. He's the one that's not really good. Yeah. He's the one that's not good. 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 You see the U.S. just, they just said they're going to build that out of space. But they made a treaty in the 60s. They're not, you can't put chemical weapons in there. You can't go out there. Yeah, I see Russia just, they came out of Russia, got a satellite that can shoot laser beams. Yeah, I got, it's already been given back. I got photos that last space shuttle that, that's the last space shuttle that came in. They came in on all the two pieces. There's some shit going on out there. They trying to say a UFO gives it. It's a war out there. It's a war, it's a war out there. The Jake don't see the signs, man. They don't see shit. They say like to see physical activity. Well, that's the shit they say. They always say the invisible man in the sky. They're like, y'all believe in the invisible man in the sky. But we can, we see chariots plenty of times. How is that invisible? You know what I mean? Invis they, they love saying that. Y'all believe in the invisible man in the sky. Y'all talking to your imaginary friend. That scripture, did it name any other places go? And I was at Isaiah. Named all kind of African countries, did it? That's a lot of bad You imagine though, because that day gonna come when they gonna wake up and realize all that flood on that thing you want up in here. Shit, be some man, we met some cool ass motherfuckers from, from, uh, from, uh, I think it was from Egypt. You know, some Arab dudes came up, and one of them was cool, they, they, we was on camera. Yeah. One of them was like, oh man, y'all speaking the truth. The other one was like, rejecting, they walked away arguing. Yeah, I remember. Man, we met some cool ass people. Even a Chinese motherfucker. Yeah, we met, we met some cool ass people. Man. We were at a rich Chinese dude. Yeah. Remember, remember, uh, remember uh, the name was Michael the Ethiopian? Yeah. He, he was he was prophesying. Yeah, yeah. He was a Jake though. Yeah. He was a Jake though. He was a, yeah. He was saying he's the Ethiopian. Yeah. But we can see his spirit. I U I S I I can't even say I U S P K. I S E C P. All these other Israelite groups, they would have called Michael the Ethiopian. They would have said he was a heathen. You really have, man. We know they all Israelite. You know that drug dealer dude? From, uh, the, uh, the, uh, uh, him. He was from, uh, 
Oh yeah, that little the Jew, remember the drunk dude that was all yeah, here. Yeah, out here clowning. You ain't seen him in a while though. Yeah. You ain't seen him in a while, dude. Oh, yeah, that's what happened. Yeah, that's a scoffer, wasn't it? Yeah. 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 That's just the beginning of woes, man. Living across the road. That's, that's just the beginning of woes. That's just the beginning, man. I be praying that don't happen to me. Oh man. That's why you know. I know, man. I that's know. Why. I know. But you know, you got to deal with it. Yep, yep. You're like Joe, you praise the most high when he fucks you up. But thank you. Why you know Because we try to get out of here. Our ultimate goal is to get the fuck out of here. That's the ultimate goal. Yeah, to see all these things. We run in that race, and you're supposed to finish that race. Who cares if you in last place? You still hold, you still finish. Yep, there's always hope. You know, uh, what's that race that, uh, what's that race the movie with Richard Pryor when he was a car racer? And that very first race he allowed to get in, he, they, they ran off the road, he crashed his shit, and he got back to the race track and he finished the race, even though he was in last place. It was much joy as home. What's up? How long do you think we're off of that? Because you had the one, the one where all the country, she can miss off of the United States. I said, do you think that's coming up? Because the missiles? Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's prophecy. That's the missiles? Because, you know, because, you know, before all that, they got other plans for it. Yeah, but the missiles are prophecy. They come in regard. Well, they're going to microchip everybody, too. Right. This will be a lot of this will be a lot of crazy shit going to happen. Like the microchip. They're going to start shipping people. Right, right. It's going to be chaos here, man. It's going to be a little, you know, the movie, The Walking Dead. Yeah, that's gonna come to reality before the missiles come. You know, it's gonna be every man starvation. for himself out here. Right, starvation. People get, get, oh, oh, massive that. diseases, yeah. and it's gonna be you hearing about it on the news, right? Diseases and deaths here and there. Yeah, you are gonna see it. That's why it's gonna be so hot, widespread. You are gonna see it everywhere, like everywhere. It's gonna be total chaos. That's why we in need of a savior. That's why he's going to crack the skies because all hell's gonna break loose. Yes, you got something. Yeah, this for you, man. Matthew 24 and 6. And they shall be healed. Like, if ye shall hear of wars and rumors of wars, see that ye be not troubled, for all these things must come to pass, but the end is not yet. Be going, be going, be going. He said, uh, see the missiles are coming, and it's just said right here, wars and rumors of wars, but the end is not yet. So what that means is that the missiles ain't gonna just attack first. You got, you got the uh, martial beast to take back. Right. You got famine, like the dogs just get into. And then the missiles will last. Right. Now, when you read those down in the street, you remember how they said that the Lord uh, was over there. So much chaos can be going on. There's going to be people out here trying to get people to go to the camp. The FEMA camp. The concentration camp, right? Yeah. There's going to be chaos going on. That's a sign that you're telling you there's going to be shit going on at a level that everybody, especially the women, they think they're out here to save it. They're going to be out here walking the streets all like you're doing now. It's going to be complete hell out here. So, you know, death is going to rule. Death is raining. It's going to rain. You know what I'm saying? But it's saying that these concentration camps, man, it's going to be scared times, man. He's going to gather these people. He's going to destroy them. That's his ultimate goal. Because they, cho they choose not to hear the word of the Lord. Okay? They choose not to hear it. But uh, you got some more out is uh, for nation shall rise against nation. Nation against nation, race war thing, great war. Black is against white. Not you see all the other African nations, they still, when you see them, they with their community. There's a separation there. Right. You know, just, that's the same, that's how you knew when they took the decree out to put the Israelites into slavery and slave times. They knew where we were, because we were always oh, separate. It's 19 and 9. But anyway, keep going, man. Nation against nation, race war. I know it's so And kingdoms against kingdoms. World War Three is going to be popping off. And there shall be famines and pestilence and earthquakes in diverse places. Hey, there was just a big giant earthquake yesterday. What was that? Right. Uh, there, was, there, was, uh, there was several of them. Oh, that's right. There's a Puerto bunch Rico. of people driving. Yeah, a whole bunch of people just died Smash yesterday. Smash. Yeah, there was just a giant earthquake in Mexico City. Mexico's still shaking at yeah. this moment. So, I mean, the seismic activity is literally off the charts right now. It's Costa Rica, please. Who said it? Costa Rica. I'm trying to think of that. Right. I'm trying to think of that. Right. 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 California's having, California's right now is having, uh, right now. As they, these tremors, wait a minute, where, where the volcano at, um, uh, the, uh, the, uh, 
Old Faithful? Yeah. Old Faithful? Is it Wyoming? Is they're having shooters right now, but, you know, they don't even want to mix them no more. They ain't stopping. They ain't stopping. Hey, I think, uh, Something major is about to happen in America. I think Yellowstone is going on, bro. Yeah, Yellowstone. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I think it is. That's what I'm talking about. They've been saying it's long overdue to yeah. flow. See, they said 200 years overdue. Yeah, so when that thing goes, Go. That's going to leave a, yeah, it look, look like a crater on the moon. But you know, he's pestilent, It's coming, man, because Trump is in motion right now, making sure it happens. You know? He talking shit, he called Kim Jong-un a little fat man. Yeah, he's out there provoking the world. Yeah. He's, he's making it. It's like he's poking a lion with a stick. He's, he's, he's making it. He's making it. So, ain't nobody going to want to deal with America no more. So, America's going to have to trouble importing and exporting. What little they do export. They lose the power, yeah. Yep. So these tells us they're coming with people like they're watching, man. One day, plus everybody's money is digital now, right? Almost everybody's money is digital. So one day they're gonna go try to buy something and that car's not gonna work. The, the bank account's gonna be no longer in existence. You know what I mean? But this is the good news, right? Oh, this is the, this the good news, but we want this to happen. Good you news. Want it to happen. Good news for us, bad news for them. Right, right. Yeah. That day, a real man is going to stand out. A real, you that, know what I'm saying? A man's going to be a hiding place. Right. Especially for these women. That day, that day is coming quick. It's coming quick, man. A real, a real man is going to stand out there. Yeah, go ahead. Women, like I said, man, you just go on the street like no worry at all. None, man. Hey, that's shit in your face and talk shit. And they are high alert on that OSU business here, right? Uh, this weekend. OSU, OU. Yup, they on alert. OU. Hey, go ahead and get that. Edomite's got an OU shit. OU. And they got the business on the street. Pop it. Don't about their business, man. Yeah. They ain't talking about it though. Ohio State. Yeah, they got a, they are high on the You don't hear my Represents Baal. It represents Osiris. You know what I mean? 
off of the tree to to hold on. And you put dead trees in there. I heard somebody said this yesterday. And, and there's a different way of looking at it. He said, man, every time you put that dead tree in your house, you essentially got a corpse of a tree in your house. It's dead. It's a dead tree. And then they chopping down all these trees. Yeah, you, you, they destroying nature just so you can have a tree in your house to worship Baal. I mean, yeah, that's a whole damn... Every house, a lot of them got real trees. They got fake trees, too. Man. Just think of how many real trees they got to cut down just for Christmas. A goddamn whole forest. A, a whole damn forest. Way. You bet you, you jacking up whole ecosystems. So a sick of What you think of uh, Halloween and shit? They just go to it, they go to the farm, whatever. Are the pumpkins? Yeah, like. Wasting all the pumpkins? Yeah, like. For the yeah, I'm from here, so you can eat that pumpkin. You know what I'm saying? You broke as fuck. You got no wasted, food. Wasted. You, like, you cook that motherfucker, but you gonna go out and you just wanna cut it and put it on the down. Yeah, that's wasted. We was actually following the bear Let's go back to the tube center walk and walk. And that's funny though, because they, they, they got that Christmas tree. It's a dead tree. A dead branch. What do you do with them dead branches, them withered branches? They, you, they get thrown in the fire. Hopefully a whole bunch of houses will burn down this year. Yeah, we probably we probably get yeah, how about some house out. And you know what? Let me say this, man. You keep, you keep getting down with keep getting down with this uh, Thanksgiving and this Christmas bullshit. This might just be the one that's gonna get you killed. Yeah, you know. Halloween we should, too. We need to go harder on this holiday. This, this. this might just be the one that's gonna get your motherfuckers killed. Keep uh, celebrating for the children's sake. The children referring to themselves too. You know. The parents is the children too. They got to mind the children. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, they're stupid, man. They're fucking stupid, man. You see grown ass men playing with balls and shit and entertaining themselves with them on the television watching other grown men playing with a ball. They're children, man. High paid children. <laughs> Jeremiah 19 and 8. And I will make this city a desolate and a history. Right now we're talking about he gonna put that pull up the hologram for dude to be the spirit oh, oh that was your chance. Yeah, that was your chance, bro. It's like all them other Israelites think they can move out of town, get their own little land. <laughs> they think, yeah, they're gonna set up a, a, a combine. That's like Pastor Dow on YouTube. Pastor Dow, he done moved out of the damn wilderness. Took him and his congregation. He took a whole bunch of They them. building houses. They prosper. They doing, uh, actually, they living large out there. But that's their reward, though. But you can't say nothing to pass it down. They think he's so, so good. Don't ever bring out no scriptures in none of his videos. Head always covered. I, I don't trust him. I bet, he, I bet he fucking all them bitches in, in his shirt. That's what it is. He's just doing that as a you know, his little private little playhouse. Yeah. 
Jeremiah 1908. That will make this city a desolate and a hissing. <laughs> Everyone that passes through shall be astonished and a hissing because of the plagues thereof. Right. Yeah, when that destruction comes, when y'all see the way it's gonna be looking out here, you'll be like, God, man. You will be astonished, like the scripture said. You're gonna be terrified. This shit's already terrifying. You ever walk around late at night by yourself? God damn. That shit can be terrifying sometimes. That can be fun, but it depends what neighborhood you're in. <laughs> That's a good attitude to have. They better worry about me. <laughs> well, you know what I mean, though. This shit, this shit is all working for us, man.
That's why I killed John Owen and fucking with you. I can just imagine one of these hoes trying to carry a machine gun or a big ass can of ammo carried up a hill. They wouldn't even make it up a hill. They'd pass out. You gotta do all the work. You like, oh baby, you need some help? Yeah, I'm tired. Yeah, I'm tired. You finish? Are y'all stressed out and stuff? Can you get that? I need a break. Hey, let's go ahead with that script. Jeremiah 19 and 9. And I will cause them to eat the flesh of their sons and the flesh of their daughters. So that's what y'all gonna be. There'll be cannibalism out here, son. Like you saying, when the economic system collapses, there ain't no money, there's no food. What y'all gonna do when there's no food in the store? You know, after a while, probably a week or so, they're gonna be cannibalism. It's gonna be quick, too. Oh, yeah, it's smart. That's smart. Say no to GMO. <laughs> Hey, that she's right though. See, some people starting to wake up to certain stuff. Right. It's like five years ago, you would have never heard somebody say no to GMO. Right. No, no, no. no to GMO. No to GMO. What's up, homie? What is this? <laughs> he said, "What is this?" I'm asking, "What is this?" <laughs> uh, the trouble all the time. <laughs> he felt he was like a ball. He's like, "What is this?" <laughs> what you, you have something against Israel? Yeah. 
Where is Israelites? Yeah, Israelites? Yeah. Yeah. And we out here with Biden. Right here. <laughs> yeah, hey, what if somebody stole your identity? What? What if somebody stole your identity and killed you and raped you and took you to slavery? Can I read this scripture for you? Yeah. You from the tribe of Judah? You from the hand tribe? You from the tribe of Judah? Boy, he got mad. He's like, what is this? <laughs> I don't know. You guys have, I'm not sure if you guys are hating on Israel. No, no, no. Listen. Somebody stole our identity. So, we're, so yes, of course, for a little bit. You know what I'm saying? Can I read a script before that? Why, you're, you're not a Jew, are you? I'm a Jew. I'm a Jew. I'm a Jew. Oh, you look like a Puerto Rican. I'm, I'm, I'm a Russian Jew. Hey, Ashkenazi? What? Ashkenazi? No, I'm not an Ashkenazi. Uh, where's your kippah? What? Where's your kippah? My kippah, it's not, it's not, it's not, it's not set. I only wear, I only wear the Shabbat. Yeah, there you go. Revelation 2 and 9. I know that works in tribulation and poverty, but, but that work rich. That's talking to us. What's real riches? What? What's the real riches? What's the real riches? Yeah. What is the real riches? Knowledge. The truth. The truth. Yeah. That's the true wisdom. Hey, let me read that again. So, like, do you read? What is that from? The Bible. The Bible. The what? The Christian Bible? The Bible. The Bible. The Bible. <laughs> But there's many books in the Bible. The Bible just means the book. Okay, what? There's the Torah, there's the Bible, there's the Quran. Right. It's the Bible. It's the same thing. It's the same thing. It's the book of Revelation. Let me, let me read this for you. Listen. I know that works. I know that works in tribulation and poverty, but thou art rich. And I know the blasphemy. Blasphemy. I know the blasphemy of them which say they are Jews. Of them which say they are Jews. And are not. And are not. But are the synagogue of Satan. You are Jews. You are not a Jew. You are not a Jew. Yeah, that's why they still have it. You are not a You know about that. Now show me that in the Torah. Show me that in the Torah. Show me in the Torah. It says it says specifically in the Torah. No, no. Yes, it's, it does. What? 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 Circumcise. To circumcise your penis? That's been done. That's been done. No, not to have a red light. No, suck, suck your penis. Where? Where does it? Okay, where did where'd you guys get this from? This, they do it on the Torah. Where? 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 I've, been, I've, been I've been to so many places. I've been so many places. I've never seen a single a single red light. Turn this fake. Turn this fake. Yes. That's you tell me that's fake. What the hell? I'm homosexual, right? What? I'm homosexual. You tell me this shit fake. Yeah. He's a dog. He's a Jew, but he's a homosexual. Now that's a new one. Jew, don't they'll fucking lose it. They'll fucking, they'll go ape shit. Yeah. Like, you're a fucking, you know, only we can be Jews. Right. Right. You know what I mean? Identity thieves. What the scripture say? I know it's like poverty, tribulation of poverty. Huh? Yo, yeah, and, and you see them devils too. You know, uh, they, they'll never uh, intermarry out their race. They, they'll, they'll get shamed. They were saying if you want to uh, move to Israel, they was trying to get it, so you had to get a DNA test to get accepted. No, that's because of the concert. Okay. Yeah. Who? Who's the concert? He's singing. Okay. Going to Israel? He's a faggot too, yeah. He can sing? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Christian singer. 
Hey, uh, Louis Farrakhan played with the Jewish Symphony Orchestra. Hey, he got skill in a body. He's been killing it. That's the only thing I could give Farrakhan credit for. I will make them of the synagogue of Satan, which say they are Jews and are not, but do thy promote. I will make them to come and worship for thy feet, and to know that I have loved thee. They're going to come out with them. They're looking at us like, oh, oh it's like, oh, oh, niggas, y'all spicks. That's how we look at it. He see, he came up there, he seen that sign, he was like, what is this? He said he was a Jew because just because he had this story, they made him a Jew. Yeah. <laughs> like that, was the, the that was moment. the confirmation <laughs> moment. You do a story, you do a, you do a search on Google, Molek comes up. I'm just doing something my arm again. I guess that's the confirmation. I know. Yeah, that's a good point because <laughs> n none of them ever wear their fringes, but they they always wear kippers. Like the Orthodox Jews would have said he was going on because he didn't have dookie curls. He didn't have the dookie curls and his head was uh, uncovered. So they would have said he was going on. They're a bunch of faggots, man. And he even said he was a homosexual, didn't he? He said, yes, I'm a homosexual. Psalms 147, verse 19. He showed his word to Jacob, the statutes and his judgment to Israel. He has not dealt so with any nation. And as far as their judgment, they have not known them. Praise ye the Lord. Yeah, that's a good point, though, because them fake Jews in Israel, they don't never wear the fringes, do they? No. Nope. They always, they, they got all these new commandments. They all dress in black. Oh, yeah, they pray to a wall. Don't they got that little comment, that little thing, every year, somebody always dies on floors. They, they say they don't round the corners of your head or beard. They, they say they use that scripture to say you got to grow the little dookie curl. Yeah, they got the verse of the Passover. Yeah, where they drink children's blood. He's not too hard. There's nothing but men in all the genealogies. You give any genealogy in the Bible, it's all men. So they're going total contradiction to the scripture. But that proves actually that they're Esau, because they're the counterfeit. They're the counterfeit Hebrew. You got the real Israelite, and then you got the fake Hebrew, which is, the, you, get, you got the right one and the counterfeit. I mean, like you said, they come with a lot of truth. They come with the scriptures. They, they got a Bible. But they give you that fucked up interpretation. Fucked up interpretation. Right. Right. That's where the old thing came from where you ain't allowed to wear a hat in the house or nothing like that. You know that Jake's family and your grandma be like, take your hat off. You buy the tree, take your hat off. They got that for the bike. It's always been a tradition of our people to take your hat off. You know, that's respect. You know what I mean? Yeah, the Catholics, yeah, they do keep their head covered, don't they? Yeah. The Pope be wearing his little uh, tiara or his little, uh, he wears, the Pope wears a kippah, just like the Jews. 
I'm wearing a fucking kill. With a clean shaven face. And all the Cardinals, the Pope, everybody got clean shaven faces. They're all Jews. Keeping it, oh yeah, they're all so called Jews. And they're all fucking pedophiles. So, but what are the ones teaching? Oh, you You cuss with the body. The, the Pope, they molest children. Got another thing, just because I say fuck. And two plus two is four, so I make this not right because I said fuck. Right. <laughs> <laughs> two plus two is two. Plus fucking two. <laughs> it's, it's but, fucking but, four. Oh, you're wrong. You're going off. Right, 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 right. But, it's, but the church is kicking to molest all the children they want, and they're still the authority. At least they didn't cuss. Right. They molested that little child, but he, I, he didn't cuss. He didn't cuss, cuss words. Yeah. I mean, these people are fucking stupid out here, man. That makes you cuss even more. These people are fucking retarded. <laughs> Confusion, man. They're fucking stupid. Confusion. Verse 5. But every woman that prayeth or prophesieth with her head uncovered dishonors her head. For that is even all one as if she were shaken. Right, because a woman got to be covered up and everything because she's because the husband is her head. So the husband's head is uncovered because he's her head. You know what I mean? Fire. Woman, woman the head, the mind. Yeah, the mind. The leader. That's the only good thing about the woman that would do something. That's probably it. Yeah. The Jewish woman do it too, but woman's married, they keep their head covered. But now they, they all of a sudden, these retards out here, these mental retards, also known as Americans, like they all against Muslim women with their head covered. They, like, don't they you know, did y'all ever even learn about the fucking pilgrims? All they had, all the bitches had their head covered. The, uh, the nuns, you ever see a nun? Nuns always got their head covered. Keep, keep your eyes off them. <laughs> keep your eyes off of them, man. Hey, that's just a, that's just a long tradition going back to the ancient world. It ain't got nothing to do with Muslim. Right. Yeah, the, the, yeah, right. Every, everybody does it but our women. The ones who started it. The ones who supposed to do it. Man, you just hate this fucking world, man. Oh, I got a sword. Hey, I have a sword. It's, you know, it's really the people that we hate. I got one. The got people that's in it. I got something. Oh, I'm saying. This is 2nd uh, Ezra 16. Hey, hey. The, no, I'm sorry, I'm looking for Like as an arrow which is shot, then they try to mark it.
Yeah, I was uh, cussing his years for like, get out because I told her, I was like, uh, I said, get a job, what the fuck? So she uh, shared my shit. It's like, this motherfucker's going on. I'm like, so what you want me to tell the people go out there and rob and sell dope? I'm like, what, what money? Then she's like, oh, you used American dollar. I'm like, well, how you pay your bills and your rent? What money you use? She never answered the question. She just kept talking about. That's advice, is it? You gotta and leave America. For life friends on the internet. <laughs> You can't say you gotta leave America. Like, we'll go where? <laughs> That's why I don't be friendly. No, no Israelite, nobody on my shit. Unless I know you personally. You know what I mean? Unless I, like, know you. Yeah, you is not on my shit, because they gonna be trying to, like, like the woman shouldn't be trying to correct no man ever. That shit ain't happening. Yeah. And I was bringing out scriptures, she ain't bring out that one scripture. I told her she didn't go get a bag. Just hated this. You trying to move the line. You one word. Oh, yeah. They they forgot the whole message. Yeah. They just focused. They focused that you said you were not you. Were. But that whole conversation is stupid. Yeah, yeah, you got people to say that. Like you sold out because you got a job. Yeah. My God damn. But if you do get a job, I mean, you can't win. Then when you don't have a job, you're a bum. You know what I mean? So, like the scripture said, uh, Yahweh Shah can't eat and drink it. They said he is devil. John can't not eat and drink it. They said he is devil. So, <laughs> so in other words, just fuck these people. Fuck what they think. Fuck what they talking about. Yeah, what they saying is, is don't matter. This cheap is mad. Yeah, that's cheap is mad. And these people's opinion doesn't matter. What they think it doesn't matter. Their feelings don't matter. It does not matter. Yeah. They're insignificant. That's how you gotta look at it. Yeah. I mean, we be praying to the Lord wake some people up, but if they don't wake up, fuck them. We ain't sitting there with losing sleep over. Right. Damn, it's tossing. He's gonna make it. He's gonna make it. Most high gave that spirit of money. negligent and not hearing the voice of the Lord, which is these these scriptures in this Bible. Y'all negligent. Y'all don't even know no scriptures. Yeah, y'all don't even, yeah, ain't never heard of a precept. What's a precept? What's a precept? Is that like a bicep? What is that? Wherefore the evils cleave unto us in the curse, which the Lord appointed out of the land of Egypt to give, give us a land that flows with milk and honey, like it is to see this day. Nevertheless, we have not hearkened to the voice of the Lord our power, according to all the words of the prophets whom he sent unto us. But every man followed the imagination of his own wicked heart. And that's what they do in America. Everybody follows after the imagination of their own wicked heart. And there's some wicked people out here. To serve strange gods and to do evil in the sight of the Lord in our power. Yeah. That's what they did, Paul. I could imagine they did strange imagination. Oh, Paul said he said y'all are superstitious. Good, bro. Don't go see Paul, you know, are superstitious. You know, the mother of the love, he said, Jake love being superstitious, man. They love clinging to all the unholy things, man. They love man. They love man. They love man. They love man. All that madness, man. 
<laughs> what do you what do you say, Paul? Man? You got the food you said, hey, in your chip. Yeah. Some of some scripture or something. Yeah, the undercut. Hey, that's I see that as an opportunity to like see. Cause they cause you had cause you had Israelites over there in Greece and uh where was that at? Ephesus. That was in Turkey, which is Greece. But the ancient Greece was was also included Turkey and all those countries. But yeah, because I mean, the ancient, a lot of them ancient Greeks were Israelites, and they at one time knew the name of the Most High. Proverbs twenty three is done. Speak not in the ears of a fool, for he will despise the wisdom of the words. Condemning you? Yeah. Condemning you? It's exposing you. That's what the pre-dead is. We got that. Yeah, you got blasts over. Proverbs 23 and 9. He's not in the hands of the fool, for he's despised the wisdom of the Lord. You see how I'm talking about that? We are here teaching the Bible. He says, the fool may despise the words of the Lord. Because a fool will always despise the words of the Lord. So if you despise the words of this Bible, that means you're a fool. So they ain't gonna have no choice but to bow down 